I was really nervous when I asked you. You shouldn't have been. I've been dying for you to ask me out for weeks. Yes! Well, that's good to hear. Uh, so, what is it that you uh, do exactly? I'm an investment consultant. <laughs> um, but I don't really want to talk about work. I've been at my job all day, you know. I just sometimes feel like I'm not in the right career. <laughs> But it was really my parents who kind of pushed me into it. They said I was so good with advice and money and that I should share it or something. Just kind of insulting, because I can do so much more than that. And I really want to. You know, Mark? Mark? Mark, are you listening? What? No, oh, yeah. No, I get it. It's a uh, uh, tough living under your parents' thumb. Tell me about it. It's like I'm still in high school sometimes. Yeah, I get it. But enough about me. Why don't you tell me more about yourself? Any hobbies, strange habits? Oh, uh, what? Um, no, I'm just an average guy. Nothing you can tell me about yourself? Uh, how am I gonna get around this? Why don't you tell me something about yourself? I just did. That's strange, they didn't give me a fork. That's weird. Mark? Hmm, what? Are you okay? Yeah, why, what do you mean? I just get the feeling that you don't want to be here. Aren't you having fun? No, yeah, I did, I, of course. Then why don't we go back to your place? Oh, uh, no, we, we can't um, go back to my place. Well, why not? I, we just, can't. Something's wrong, Mark. I know it. No, nothing's wrong. I just... I, you can't... You don't want to come back to my place. I, I'm, I'm totally into you, Julia. I am. I'm just... distracted. Because... You wouldn't understand. I guess not. Well, have a great night alone. And thanks for dinner. I may be a thief, but I'm not a criminal. I'm just like everyone else. It sort of just happened one day. There was no defining moment where I knew I had a problem. All of a sudden, I just felt I needed things. Anything. And for what? I really don't know. I wish I could tell you that myself. Sometimes, I don't even realize what I'm doing. It sneaks up on me. Damn it! I tried therapy, but that didn't work. So tell me, Mark, what is it that makes you want to commit a crime? Is it the thrill of breaking the law? No, it's not that. Um, it's just... Mark, any way you spin it, you're still breaking the law. You're committing a crime, which makes you a felon. A felon? You know, I understand what I'm doing. I get it. I try to stop, and I know it's bad, but... I, I just, I can't. All I see here, Mark, is a lack of self-control and civic responsibility. I can't help you with your problems unless you accept what you truly are. How about this? Let's try looking into the cause of the problem. We can revisit the moral standing at a later time. Now, have you been feeling depressed lately? No. Trouble sleeping? No. Suicidal thoughts? No. Violent urges? No. Hmm. Did you have siblings or family members who shoplifted? No. Did your parents ever steal your toys from you? No. Have your parents ever... hit you? No. <laughs> well, shit, I don't know. I think we're done here. Yeah. Sorry. I can't stand how it ruins certain social situations, but yet 
I amaze myself sometimes of what I can get away with. Yeah, man. Any, huh? any time. Any, any time. Seriously, yeah, totally. seriously. No, this was see, great. Was... See, see the hit me yeah, up later, man. I'll see, I'll I'll see guess you later. Little. This is a great party. Okay, thank you. Yeah, um, bye. See you, man. Alright. I don't want to feel like this. Uh, this is just feeling that I get. It's like I have no control over myself. I hate it. I want to stop, but how? How can I ignore that itch? Once it starts, it's like I got blinders on. All I want to do is live like everyone else. To have friends, relationships, a job. So, were you at that party last night? It was, no. It was, you were. It was, was, it was there, insane, yeah. remember? How that, that, that girl, Susie? Don't she do was, it. Was, like, on the Don't, you're crossing the moral boundaries that shouldn't be arm. crossed. Take that fry, you're an asshole. That is not your fry if you have no right to eat it. No good human being ever steals fries. Don't you dare. Don't eat that fry. Don't eat that. And she was like, hell yeah. And then she jumped, right? And then we had to rush her to the hospital. It was crazy because we didn't have a car. Remember that? So we had to get like 50 people to carry this chick. Like literally 50 people, everybody from we just rushed her to the hospital, and then we found out that that oh my god, we found out that she broke her neck, and it was hilarious. We were all dying in the, in, in the, like the room. We were laughing. Remember that? It was pretty. We funny. were laughing. We were laughing hysterically, but she was all like crying and like she can't. She does cheerleading. I can't ignore it anymore. I'm gonna get rid of it all. Clean slate. That's what they say, right? Maybe if I can get rid of all these things, I can get rid of my problem. Maybe.